Okay, Landon, uh, I'm going to show you how to use the lawnmower. Uh, first of all, of course, it's electric, and this cavity is where your battery goes into. It's a, kind of a large battery that goes in right there. So we'll go get the battery in the shop. It's right here. you got two of them. You, so, you, so while one's charging, you can use the other. So we're just going to slide this out. All right. And you can see that there are some teeth, teeth right here on the end of the battery. And these teeth slide into those metal things. So you just want to make sure you put it with this 40 max facing up like that. And you can let it drop. Well, most of the time. Snap it in. Okay. And um, put this out in the grass. So, as you can see, there's a couple of handles here and this little blue button and a blue lever right there. So, to crank it, what you do is is you hold this button in right there and then you pull this right there and you can hear it okay and then this back lever right there that's the uh, self-propelled so when you when you um when you pull it up it'll go you pull it up it goes and then so that's the self-propelled lever. So again, you just press on the start, pull this in while you're holding it down, and it cranks up. And you can let that go, and you keep this in. If you let that go, it'll just go off. Okay. So start there, keep this in, and for the self-propelled to go, you just do that. Let off. And you can push it if you want to without the self-propelled, but when you're doing that, the self propel. And then this lever right here will make it go slower or faster. That right there is what I keep it on most of the time. That's that's right in the middle. And uh, that, that control, controls the speed. If you want it to go faster, you push forward. You're not going to need it to go faster than midways right there. So when you first start using it, it's going to be on midways. Now, if you're going along a wall, brick wall or the fence or if you if you're going somewhere where you got to be a little bit more intricate then you can lower the speed by one notch right there you can lower the speed by one notch but and, and um, so anyway and then also you see those green dots that's the, uh, how much power you have left in the battery. So when this last dot on the right, when that last dot on the right starts blinking, that just lets you know that it's starting getting low on power. You can keep mowing, but expect it to just go off anytime. And um, uh, you can probably figure that one battery will get you the backyard and one battery will get you the front yard. And um, let's see. Um, I think that's just about it. But again, to power it on, you press the start button, pull in this lever, and it'll start going, or the um, blade will start going. And then this is the self-propelled right there. And actually, you see that you don't have to have the mower running for that to work. So you don't have to push it whenever, even when it's off. And then here's the lever to control the speed. Now I'm going to put it in the mid minute and that's where i keep it most of the time but if you want it to go a little bit slower which sometimes you may you just bring it towards you a little bit um and just if you would just mow the yard once a week so like every sunday just mow the yard you don't have to edge you don't have to do anything like that but just take your time and mow the backyard and the front yard and um one thing i'll mention to you is is um
Um, just be aware that we need to get this strip right here uh, whenever we mow. And of course get this as well. And, um, and I'm gonna remove the, um, the Halloween decorations so you won't have to, have to mow around them. But anyway, I appreciate it, baby. Just, do, just mow the yard once a week. I'm gonna mow it today, this Sunday. And so next Sunday, just start mowing it every Sunday. And of course, hopefully I'll be back in maybe four to six weeks. I'll be working in Georgia. But I do appreciate you and I love you, okay? Bye-bye.